Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Autonauts. Let's expand our berry farm and our berry production, spice berries, all that good stuff. Let's expand it all today. So we're adding another 10 cooking pots for spice berry making. So let's get that set up. Oh, what is with this lighting? This lighting looks weird. All right, we're gonna set it up like this. Well, that was weird. It's like the sun just turned on. The heck? All right, this should definitely take care of our spice berry needs right here. Probably a little overboard. A little hard to see what's going on, but I mean, I guess it's efficient, right? All right, so we got 10, so now we need another 10 more. Spiced berry maker 11. There we go. Then let's program. That mixing pot, that one, that one, and that one, and pull from that storage. Good to go. All right, I won't hit play on this. I forgot I need to come over here and set all these recipes. There we go. All right, now that they're set, I can play number 11. All right, let's make nine more. Spice berry make a 12. All right, should I go straight down, you think? Or should I just zigzag bang? I guess it doesn't matter, right? I'll just go straight down in rows. All right, that should be good. Need another one. Spice berry maker 13. I keep on the space. Keep forgetting I don't have enough room. Thirteen is going to be the third one in the line. There we are, and I can totally just click, once a bot shows up here, there we go, and just click that. Spice Berry Maker 14. Come on, Charger Bot. Thank you. All right, number 14, there you are. Okay, this is probably gonna put a strain on our berry production. Like an actual farm, so now we might have to expand that a bit. We'll see once all this is done. We'll see where where we end up. Alright, next one's ready. Spice bear beery? Berry maker 15. Alright. Last one in the row. There we are. Play that. And where's the next one? Alrighty. Number 16. Set all this up. I don't know why they're all called, called number nine. Maybe it's because when I was doing the build order type of a thing, I clicked to have the blueprints all made like at the same time without exiting the menu. So maybe it just names them all the same at that point. I'm not too sure why it does it like that. Cause like all these are named nine. The last couple I made were eight, but then like all these are just evenly numbered. I'm guessing it's because when you're in this menu, if say I click masonry bench, that would be like number four. If I exit out and do this, that'd be like number five. But then if I do this, it'd be like number six, number six, number six, number six. I think that's how this does it. That's the only way it makes sense for me why it would do that. It seems like a weird choice if that's what it does. Cause yeah, some of these are like number one, number eight, number three. 
to. And I'm pretty sure I made these in groups. Like all these ones that are named nine, I had them making at the same time. So I think that's what causes that. All right, what number are we on? 16, all right, 17. Spies, berry, maker. 17. Good to go, buddy. All right, beautiful. Wait, what? Wait, what? Total spice berry storage is full. Oh. Oh. Okay, so that storage is full, but before we move on to it, let's get the last couple bots programmed. Then we'll figure out why that is full and not being used. Spice berry maker 18. Alrighty. Now where's number 19? Perfect timing. All right, one more after this. And just like that, we all of a sudden have 20 bots making spice berries when just an episode or two ago we had like, what, four? Making spice berries? That's insane. Spice berry maker 20. It's a thing of beauty. Thing of beauty. Alright, click that one and that one. That one and that one, and we are good. All right, so now why are the stewed berries not making, like why are you guys stuck? You're looking for fresh water. Oh, is it because I like move them mid cycle? I think that's what that is. So this one's waiting for berries. What are you holding? It's looking for berries, but we have... Okay, so that's easy enough. I could just add that. Okay, so that picks up. Okay, so that one's reset. This one's ne needing water, so I need a bucket. Hey, look, a bucket. Alright, I'll do your job for you. And what part are you stuck on? You're stuck at the start. Okay, so that's good. So that means once I finish this, you'll be all set. There we go. And what are you stuck on? You need water as well? Oh my god, you see how that massive amount of berries come back at one? Oh my god. Oh my god, it's just a train of bots. Oh my god, we have a ton of weeds. Nice. Look at them go! Oh my god, it's it's so awesome to see that work. I've never had that so far in a game. This is like mass production right here. Alright, that's done. Now that's reset, and this spot, where's the spot at? I don't know what bot is in charge of this one. Yeah, what bot is in charge of this? Dude berry maker. So five is going, cool. Six is going, four is. Take. What? Do you have too much in your hand or something? You don't. Then why don't you take? Hello? Move this. You're at Spiceberry Storage, dude. 
All right, well, I'm gonna take... Oh, you have a bucket in your hand, I see. There we go, so that should take care of that bottom one. So who's waiting on for these berry jam makers? What are you doing? Take from honey storage, okay. And where are you going? Wait, where'd he go? Oh, I see, they got... Add a cauldron. Okay, so this one needs honey. The other ones are stuck because they have stewed berries in their hands. I got it. Okay, so this one needs a honey added. Simple enough, I'll just go do that. And then these ones, I need to take the berries out of their hands and then they'll be good to go. All right, got honey, so if I add this, I should complete this recipe and he'll be good to I love seeing this, look at this train. Look at that train. And then they all just start adding like crazy. That is just a thing of beauty to see. All right, so that's done. So now I can add this, oh my God. So heavy. Nice. All right, so now we can come down here, talk to all these bots, get the stewed berries out of their hands. And then if I add that there, there we go. So what about you, same thing? Get that out of, nope, nope. Here, drop that. All right. Get that out of the hand, put the ha that in the bucket, and now you can take the honey. Same with number three. Oh, no, number four. That out of your hand. Give you that bucket. There you go. Now we should be making jam like crazy. And then I don't think we have the jam collector going or something. I don't think he's played. Yep, perfect. So now you should start collecting. God, we have so many stewed berries. This is awesome. I think we need another feeder. Let's pick up the stewed berries. All right, and then let's get another feeder. So that's gonna be under love makers. Yeah, oh, let's also add all these. To the berry farmers, or the berry chefs. There we go. And now, what was I looking at? Love makers, baby feeder. We can just use you, all right. Save your programming, nice. And then we just load it in here. Baby feeder, load it up. Good to go. Eventually what I think we'll do is we'll have one baby feeder take care of these 10 and another baby feeder take care of 10 that are here. Cause I still have six more I have to set up. And that time might be approaching. We'll have to see how this berry jam situation works out. If we have enough, like enough being produced fast enough, we could probably just go ahead and get these other six colonists going. Let's just see how all this plays out. Okay, they're pulling from the stewed berries fast enough. That's good. They just need to go get honey and stuff. Yeah, you just see the berries flowing out of this thing. I don't know, that gives me so much joy. And then just hearing them all plop in.
Nice. I have a feeling some stuff's dead somewhere. Because I'm not paying attention. Oh, yep, yep, yep. Stone. Wait, is our stone deposit dead? Oh. Oh, yeah it is. Yeah it is. Crinkerbot lollipop. Crinkerbot lollipop. We gotta charge him up. Where am I at? Why am I taking... Did I just run through the water? Alright, we'll hub crank a bit here. Alright, go crank that guy. There you go. Everything's back and working in order. Alright, how's this doing? So let's see if this keeps building up. Oh, this is stuck again. Oh, doesn't have fuel. No fuel, that's not good. Berry chefs. Cooking pot, fuel man. Oh, these need fuel too. And it's not expanded out. I see. Cauldron, it's over there. And then the cooking pots are for now going to be within that range. There we go. So that's why berry jam wasn't going. So we got to watch this for a sec. See if it all evens out. Where is our fuel man coming? Where is he? Guy carrying a bunch of logs. That's all we need. Oh, planks are really taking a hit. Probably from the flooring. Whoa, 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 whoa. What flooring are we making? Uh-oh. Oh my god, I clicked the wrong one. Actually, that's not too bad. It only uses four planks. I kind of like that. That's what we call a happy accident. It's actually the same amount of wood. It's four planks versus two planks and a log, which a log makes two planks anyways. So it's just a process. It's just a question of like, do you want to take more planks versus just take a raw log? I actually like that flooring. I wish it wasn't as dark, but I really like the pattern. Might have to start using that. I mean, we're definitely gonna use it now since it's already built. All right, there we go. Berries jam being made. Cooking pot fuel man. All right, there you go. Gonna find more cauldrons. So they should be able to power two of them, right? Or to get this one. So yeah, right now the berry jam is going in and then immediately. It is immediately being taken out to feed. How many bots are still hungry? Or colonists? One, oh, one? Just one, but a lot of them are about to be hungry at the same exact time. Yeah, look at this. It's almost like you could see the order they got fed by looking at the the feed meter there. And then these are kind of the same. Yeah, like that's gonna die, then this one, then all these. Okay, so we'll see. We'll see if we can keep up with that demand. We're at two. It's not bad. Do we got bo both are going, right? The feeders? BB feeder two, BB feeder one. Yep, they're both gone. Wait, what are you waiting on? Find nearest stone cottage hungry. Oh, they're not hungry yet. I got it. They're getting there. It's just taking a while for it to empty. Oh, there they go. Okay, and there should be another hungry one coming up. Should be this one's next. And then that one should immediately take off. All right, come on, go hungry. And hungry? Oh, it's coming early. Beautiful. 
And now the next one's going probably for the one right below that. Yep, sure enough. And then this one should be coming out right away. Ichigo should be next. Oh, you're not. You're not going. Oh, there you go. Nice. And how's our stewed berries going? We're still at 49. We've been just sitting at 49 for a while. So that means we're like using the same amount we're we're making right now. So that's actually really good. Not too much. This is at 92, which is good. That also means we don't have overproduction. Doesn't also means we're not underproducing at this time. Our berries look like they're taking a hit though. So if that's the case, we might need one or two more berry patches. Might need one or two more berry patches here. All right, got our wub going. How's our research? Halfway there. Halfway there, just about. It's not terrible, not terrible. And we do have to keep in mind that this is only, what, 5, 10, 14? We're going to add another 6. Although, I think Berry Jam can actually keep up. Again, the question is whether or not we'll be able to keep, keep up with the actual berry production. The actual farming of the raw berries. That seems like it's going to be our bottleneck now. But yeah, we wanted to get all this done before we even dip our toes into metalworking. Because we want to be able to just sit there and have research go. Not have to worry about weed production, not have to worry about berry production, or research just being slow because we're waiting for food. So if we can get just food cranking out and making sure that clothing's taken care of, which I know clothing's fine. And the plush toys are taken care of now since I fixed the wooden button issue. I think we are pretty close to golden here. All right, we're at six. It was at four, right? And they are just still in the upper 40s. Beautiful. Beautiful. I think we're going to call this episode a little bit early. I have to probably get the next six colonists underway. And I know if I start that now, it's probably going to bleed a little too much time out of this episode. Probably get to like 45, 50 minutes. And that's way, way, way too long. So we're going to call it here. And we are going to finish out expanding and leveling up our colonists all to tier four and take care of all of that on the next episode. So until then, take it easy, everyone.